<laughs> There's some here. We see some more scattered about. Uh, I believe all we have right out now are the young ladies. There's the young one laying down for a nap. Now check out the horns on some of these young ladies. Now they have two horns, and you'll, you'll notice how large their heads are. And look behind their heads, up on their shoulder, that huge chunk of muscle. Now, because the way their heads are so big and because of that muscle, they can't lift their heads. So they strictly graze off the ground. And since they can't lift their heads, they can't swim. If they get into water that's a little deeper than their knees, potentially they could be in trouble. Now, we have six generations here. We have great, great, great grandmother, great, great grandmother, great grandmother, grandmother, mother, and daughter. In a human care, they can live 30 in the wild, of course, they live much shorter, and the reason is because of poaching. Uh, the only time that a rhino is really um, subject to being uh, prey from a predator is when they are very young, newborn, and a little older, and when they get very old or if they're injured or 